Greetings, world history students. I'm here to help you with chapter 13, section 4 questions. Again, the green, blue, and black questions are all taken right out of your textbook, and the red questions are ones that I've developed to help you read in a more focused manner so you don't get lost like I do sometimes. So, starting at the beginning in chapter 13, section 4, let's look for each of these answers. Push, pause. And don't push play for the next question until you've found the answer to the previous question. That way you won't miss anything. Number one, what happened as the Protestant Reformation continued? The next one, what made Anabaptists different? And in the next section with the checkpoint question, why was the Church of England established? look for what made Henry the eighth change his mind about the church who was appointed the only supreme head on earth of the Church of England by the Parliament how did Henry strengthen the Church of England Who was burned at the stake for heresy under Queen Mary's rule? How did the Elizabethan settlement help England escape more uh, religious wars? In the next section with the checkpoint question, what was the outcome of the Catholic Reformation? Look for what did the Catholic Church do in response to the Reformation? What steps did the Council of Trent take to direct the reform of the Catholic Church? What kind of books did the Inquisition ban? Describe the Jesuits. Who was Teresa of Avila? What were the results of the Catholic Reformation and Protestantism? And in the next section with the checkpoint question, why were Jews and other people persecuted? Look for why were people accused of witchcraft? And how did treatment of Jews worsen over time in Europe? Thanks for tuning in. Uh, please take a second and fill out the survey I have linked to this uh, video to let me know if these are helping or not um, or how I could improve them. And we'll see you next time. Goodbye.